check things on the boys in the uh, yard. In the, uh, it's better than yours. Jennifer Lopez, the girl. I mean, I really love you, but like your album flops. You might not be returning to American Idol next season, and now you're announcing your divorce. I mean, like, girl, are you serious? Is this what you really want to be announcing right now? I mean, like, your career is already on life support, and they just want to turn around and say, oh, yeah, you getting a divorce too. I'm like, girl, over here quick, girl. Oh, my God, girl, how hot money is this? Like, I'm nothing, girl. Like, y'all really see this, like, on Luke Kim level. Are you sure you really want to be announcing that? Like, somebody get over here to do some chest compressions or some girl, like, Bring this bitch back to life. Like, Jennifer Lopez, I really want you to be, like, relevant. I mean, like, because, like, your skin is smooth and, like, your hair is long and, like, your body is amazing. And, like, I'm going to say you can sing, but you really can't. I mean, like, but at least, like, when you cry on American Idol, like, I almost want to believe it. I mean, like, can you at least stay relevant for, like, more than five minutes? I mean, like, I remember this song, oh, I kind of sort of don't remember, because bitch, I don't remember the name of it, but this song she did with Ja Rule, I mean, like, whatever the name of it was, I mean, like, they replaced Ashanti to put you on the record, so, I mean, like, that's kind of big, I mean, like, replacing Ashanti, I mean, like, that's like a milestone, like, don't you want to be relevant, I mean, like, that's a big accomplishment in your career, girl. And next, I want to talk about Netflix, because Netflix is really doing the most. I mean, I secretly believe that Netflix is only doing this $7.99 DVD, $7.99 streaming thing, because they really want us all to, like, delete our our DVD subscriptions anyway. Because, I mean, like, it costs money. Like, um, they got to buy the DVDs, then they got to mail them out to you, then they got to offer you free to mail them back to them, and then they got to mail you. Like, bitch, just stream online and, like, clearly, so we don't have to do all this shit, this mail. United States Postal Service is already talking about deleting Saturday delivery any fucking way to cut the fucking budget. So, I mean, I kind of sort of believe that they just want to be, like, the number one stream. They want to be number one in something. I mean, because clearly when Redbox came along, they they weren't number one at anything anymore. And then, hell, at least they made Blockbuster clothes. I mean, when's the last fucking time a beach went to Blockbuster? I mean, girl, seriously. <laughs> Basketball wives. Mika, please go have a seat. Bitch, you begged for like years. I mean, like two and a half years. You say like your assistant did it for you. But bitch, only because you told her. Bitch, if you was happy with your marriage with whatever his name is, whatever whatever team he's on or whatever the fuck he does. I mean, you clearly wouldn't have been had your cousin, your baby daddy's friend, or whoever the fuck that was you you claim was, girl, go have a seat. Because clearly you begged to be on the show. And Tammy is right. I'm all the way team Tammy. Tammy's like, bitch, I'm going to be here when you go, boo-boo. I'm going to be here when you go. And Tammy was telling the motherfucking truth because, bitch, girl... I just can't. Mika, I just can't. And how about Susie? No, Susie, she sat at the table. And then I was like, so Susie, we really don't want the rest of the guy. And she's like, I'm still going, bitch. It's the motherfucking, where the fuck we going? Home? I'm down. And then I like, go turn around and go tell. Oh, girl, you know, it came up and they said they didn't want you. But did you say, oh, but bitch, when they said, was I down, bitch? Hell yes, at the motherfucking. Uh, <clears throat> Yep, mm -hmm. I jumped, bitch. I was down. Bitch, Brandy, back in 94, I want to be down, bitch. I was down. No tea. No problems for me. Let's go. Grab your backpacks. Dora style, bitch. This bitch was ready to go like it was no motherfucking beat. And then, like, I just don't understand how Shani acts like she's this all, oh, you know, I'm just the calm one. And then on the first episode of this thing, she was like, we're going to try to bring some, some, Whatever the fuck Shani wants to bring, but she can't never bring it because she's fucking Shani. Girl, go have Shani can have a seat too, because she act like she's this innocent one and she's just the innocent bitch. What what this new man that you left Shaq for, can we see him in the episode? I really want to see him because you act like he's just this shit. He looks like Ace Rockwood, bottom it out, and like every thugboy.com, poppythugs.com, all these fake thugs. Dot O-R-G, girl. Have a fucking seat with this um, minute man it looks like you got. Girl, have a seat. Shani can just... And then she stays talking about Royce. I mean, like... Okay, so first of all, Royce really, is, really isn't even relevant. First of all, like, this the most 
this person you can find to hate on the most. How about you hate on somebody who was once married? Like, hate on Jennifer. I mean, Jennifer is fucking lame. I mean, like, are you serious? Jennifer is so fucking lame. Hate on Jennifer. Hey, at least she's the only one who was ever actually really married other than Tammy, but you don't want to get on Tammy's bed. So let's just skip Tammy. And then, I mean, like, Jen Evelyn was engaged. So, I mean, does she really count? I mean, please. I mean, like, other than Jennifer, you, she's the only one who you can really... Hey, on, Russ, she's the motherfucking baby mama. Are you serious? Girl, she don't even have to see. Shout out to all the hardworking bloggers out there. I'm trying to get into ads because I really only, I really started RonaldMatters.com because I really love blogging. I mean, I'm, I want to be a journalist. I want to tell people, I want to help inform people about what's going on in the world around them. But, you know, bitch putting in some hard work. Bitch, get your motherfucking money. Put some, and I decided I got to get some ads up. I've got to do what I got to do to get my fucking money because, bitch, it's, blogging is a, a regular job. I mean, like, I started it for fun, but it's a regular fucking job. Where the dollars at? <laughs> Lastly, I want to give some advice. You know, be about what you say you are. I mean, because, like, your word, like, if you have, like, if you don't have any money, you don't have a big house, you don't have anything, like, all people have to go off of is your word. So be about what you say you're about. Like, if you say, oh, I don't like him. He's not the one for me. Well, bitch, don't be texting him, calling him, all up in his face. Don't be doing this shit, because this shit is not cute. Because you give off, like, mixed signals. If you say, well, oh, I don't really like you like that, but, like, you're all up in his face. I mean, like, so how can I tell, how can I tell that you don't really like me? Like, you're not really into me. Because a lot of dudes tell me all the time, like, well, you know, I tried to talk to you online, but you really weren't, mm. And then I was like, well, online you really weren't, Mm, worthy. So I mean, you got mm, so bitch, take what you can get. And they're like, what? But like, I see people like all up in people's face, and they really aren't into them. But bitch, like, you say you are into them, but like, you do everything totally after that. Y'all are Facebook friends. Y'all messaging back and forth. Y'all are tweeting. Y'all are doing all this. Probably hanging out. Who's to know? I mean, but like you say, you really aren't into that person. But like, I'm the type of person. Like, if I'm not into you, you. You would know I'm not into you. I mean, like, because I put a bitch on. Girl, is it the moon coming out? Isn't it clear? What the fuck is going on, girl? But, you know, like, everybody's not like me. And they say I'm blunt. I'm rude. I'm too honest. And I'm all this other shit. But, bitch, at least when a bitch know I don't like them, they know. And if I did like you, you would know. I'd be posting you on Facebook. I'd be DMing you on Twitter. Like, so when are we going to make this happen? You know, because the bitch running it down. Down. So, I mean, this is all I really have to say, Ronald, randomly.